All right, guys, the Godzilla vs. Kong trailer just came out like about three minutes ago. We're gonna watch it right now in three, two, one. This is our only chance. Some crazy stuff going on. They got Kong, Isa Gonzalez. I didn't know she was in this movie. Godzilla is just vibing. The world needs him. To stop what's coming. And there's a child. She's the only one he'll communicate with. So, his little girls, like King Kong's friend. She had nowhere to go, so I made a promise to protect her. And I think that in some way, Kong did the same. Godzilla coming out of nowhere. Oh snap! It's Godzilla. Yo, Godzilla's angry. Oh snap! He just knocked him out. Yo, this song's lit. Oh, you an atomic breath in us. Oh, snap. These are dangerous times. That city. That city looks so freaking cool. Is this cyberpunk or something? Yo, Millie Bobby Brown. Yo, Paperboy. Oh, I didn't know he was in this movie. There was a war. And they're the last one standing. We're gonna see like Mecha Ghidorah or whatever, they're not the last ones. Who bows to who? Oh snap! Kong bows to no one. Yo, this looks so dope. Whoa! Dang, bro. That looks so cool. That last shot, that's the money shot. That's every, everyone's gonna see it in there just because of that shot. <laughs> That looks so dope. It's an HBO Max, I think, in March with Justice League and a bunch of others. I think it's going to be fantastic. Now, I do have my gripes. Gonna going to get real for a bit. I don't like Godzilla. I don't like Kong vs. Uh, Skull Island. I don't like Godzilla, King of Monsters. Because the monsters are in it for 5 minutes, 10 minutes. Maybe even 15 minutes max, there's action with the monsters. Godzilla, the first one, I loved it because Brian Bryan Cranston. And then Brian Cranston gets killed off halfway through the movie. I didn't care for that. And then they rely on the villain in the first Godzilla. And then every Godzilla fight is just... You, you see Godzilla punch and then the camera moves away. Terrible. I, I don't go to a Godzilla movie to see Brian Cranston run around. Is it entertaining? Yes. But do I want to see it? No. And then Congress of Skull Island, Samuel Jackson, uh, John Goodman, Brie Larson, they're all fun and everything. But dude, I want to see God, uh, I mean, King Kong do some craziness, and you do in a bit of it. And I think Kong is the best out of the trilogy of the movies we've seen because of the action, and it's filmed a little better. And then Godzilla, King of Monsters is... I literally, I literally, you want to you wanna correct me? I literally went through the movie yesterday, and there were like maybe 15 to 20 minutes of Godzilla action. That was it. And you know what's funny? The, the 20 minutes came from the end of the movie. He's in the movie maybe five minutes of screen time throughout the two hour film. And I hate that, dude. I do not want to go to Godzilla, King of Monsters, to see him in the movie for 20 minutes. I want to see him wrecking everybody. I don't, want, I don't need to see Ghidorah doing all the work. I need to see Godzilla. So I'm super hyped for this because it looks like we got action off the bat. It looks like we have that Neo Tokyo City at the end like they were fighting at. And I think that's going to be super cool. Will it be good? I don't know. Will the action be dope with them fighting? Yes, because that's what we're going for. And they know they got to make that look good. But Millie Bobby Brown, Isaac Gonzalez, all of them running around trying to figure out some big thing about how these monsters came and why they're fighting. That's, it's, let, let's see how they do it. Let's see. Let's see if they learned of the three movies that we do not care about the humans running around. We care about the monsters. So I'm super excited for this. If you're excited for this, let me know in the comments below. 
this is going to be hype. HBO Max is filled in when this comes out. I think Justice League Snyder Cut comes out in March. This comes out in March. Friends Reunion comes out in March. So it's super hype to have uh, HBO Max. And just to have theaters in general. You can go see this in theaters as well. And I think that's a dope option. But anyways, guys, if you like this video, like, comment, subscribe, and bend on.